good morning all in the series of lectures of beta distribution of first kind today we will see what is mode of beta distribution of first kind so to find the mode of any distribution it must so we know that mode is nothing but highest frequency or mode is nothing but the value of x where the pdf is maximum so to find the maximum for continuous data set we need to have the it need to satisfy the condition of maxima and the condition of maxima becomes f dash of x is equal to 0 and the second condition f double dash of x is less, less than 0 for the value of x a is, is equal to a okay so over here our since x follows beta distribution of first kind with parameter mn therefore pdf of x is we have fx is equal to 1 divided by beta mn x raised to m minus 1 1 minus x raised to n minus 1 for the range of x 0 to 1 mn greater than 0 is equal to 0 otherwise okay over here let for our simplification purpose we consider fx is equal to f and taking log of both the sides so what we get log f is equal to log of 1 divided by beta m comma n plus what i have plus m minus 1 log of x plus plus i have n minus 1 log of 1 minus x okay now since we need to take derivative to differentiate with respect to x to x what we get we get this as f dash divided by f is equal to derivative of this is 0 plus derivative of this term is m minus 1 upon x because derivative of log x is 1 upon x plus derivative of this term n minus 1 derivative of this is 1 divided by 1 minus x and again derivative of 1 minus x is minus 1 okay so i have f dash is equal to m minus 1 upon x minus n minus 1 upon 1 minus x into f okay over here we need to put f dash is equal to 0 so if f dash is equal to 0 then what we get c therefore m minus 1 upon x minus n minus 1 upon 1 minus x f is equal to 0 okay so let me simplify this to get the value of x obvious to get the value of x so what is simplification so m minus 1 upon x is equal to n minus 1 upon 1 minus x now we cross multiply so m minus 1 1 minus x is equal to n minus 1 into x so what we get c m minus 1 minus mx minus minus plus x is equal to nx minus x so let me have terms of x over here so m minus mx plus x minus na plus x okay so this is equal to now i have 1 minus m fine okay now out of these i have x as common so in the bracket i have minus m minus n plus 2 is equal to 1 minus n so let me have the term as x is equal to 1 minus m upon minus m minus n plus 2 so this is equal to multiply the inequality by minus 1 what we get we get m minus 1 divided by m plus n minus 2 so that is the value of x so we get the value of x as m minus 1 divided by m plus n minus 2 fine okay now let me take the second derivative of this term so second derivative of this term is f double dash is equal to the formula is u into v okay so i have the derivative as m minus 1 upon x minus n minus 1 upon 1 minus x into f dash plus i have the derivative of this term now so the derivative of this term is see the derivative of this term so derivative of this is m minus 1 divided by minus x square since the derivative of 1 upon x is minus 1 upon x square 
minus n minus 1 divided by 1 minus x square and I have c. Again, since it is square, I have minus minus plus and again I have derivative of 1 minus x, it is minus 1. Fine? Into f. Okay. Now, this is equal to put the value of f dash and the value of f dash is m minus 1 upon x minus n minus 1 upon 1 minus x square into f into what I have m c. I have suppose minus as common out of these two I have minus in the bracket m minus 1 upon x square plus n minus 1 upon 1 minus x square into f. So if you observe all the terms f is greater than 0 this is a square term that means it is positive. And if you observe this term minus, I have m minus 1, x square is positive, 1 minus x square is positive. m is greater than 0, n is also greater than 0, and f is also greater than 0. That means this term is negative. And hence we write this as f double dash is less than 0. Since both the conditions are satisfied, we say that this is the value of mode for beta distribution of first kind, and it is m minus 1 divided by m plus n minus 2 simply thank you for watching my video please subscribe my channel